is Dan Seifert with The Verge, and we are looking at the new Samsung Galaxy Note 4. It's the latest in Samsung's Galaxy Note line of smartphones and phablets. Note 4 actually has a number of upgrades over last year's Note 3. Same size 5.7 inch screen, but now it is actually a QHD uh, 2K display as opposed to the 1080p model from last year. Really looks great. It's got great viewing angles, great colors. It's super AMOLED, so it's very uh, vibrant and saturated. Uh, and there are visibly no pixels. Uh, and then the other big design change here is the new all metal band around the side of it. This may look familiar if you are familiar with the Galaxy Alpha that Samsung announced a few weeks back, uh, but it's an all metal band here. Really improves the quality of the device as far as holding it in your hand. Feels a lot better than the plastic material Samsung used to use. Uh, on the back here, it's got the same kind of soft touch material, but gone are the fake leather stitching, which is a huge improvement, if you ask me. Uh, the camera's been improved to a 16 megapixel module, uh, up from last year's, I believe was eight megapixel. And then it's got the uh, integrated heart rate monitor that we saw on the Galaxy S5. Samsung says that the camera is uh, a major improvement in that it has optical image stabilization, which is the first that for Samsung. So it lets you zoom in further on digital zoom as well as get sharper pictures in low light. Uh, we've seen a couple of manufacturers use optical stabilization, but this is the first for Samsung. And then on the front facing camera, you've got a new higher resolution front facing camera that has some new tricks up its sleeve. You can just tap the display to take a picture or you can use the heart rate sensor on the back. Samsung's also improved the battery charging on this, so now it can charge from zero to 50% in just 30 minutes with the rapid charge technology. Uh, and of course, it's got a big removable battery, just like any other Samsung Galaxy uh, smartphone in the past. So you can take the battery out, you can add a micro SIM card if you need to. Samsung isn't announcing exact price and release date for the Galaxy Note 4 just yet, but it will be available here in the US as well as across the world. Uh, in the US, you're gonna be able to get it on Sprint, AT&T, Verizon, and T-Mobile. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching that video. The first thing you should do if you liked it is click the thumbs up button down below. Then, if you haven't already, you should subscribe to our channel over here. It's awesome, you'll love it. And you'll especially love these two videos, which you should watch right now, because really, what else are you doing?